All right, I'm coming to you today to show you. I've probably been doing this for about two months, and I really like the results, so I figured I'd share it with you. Um, this turmeric face mask, or turmeric, I guess it depends on what part of the world you're from. Some people say turmeric, some people say turmeric, doesn't matter. But it's a turmeric face mask. And what you need, chickpea flour or graham flour. It's called chickpea flour, but it's also known as graham flour. And it's also known as basan, I guess, B-E-S-A-N. So if you go to one of your Asian slash Indian markets, this is what you need. I think it was like $2.99. This was $5.99. It's your turmeric powder or your haldi powder right here. This one right here, this little bag, this was some mixed with some oat flour that I had left over. And so, yeah. So you'll just take some spoonfuls of it. I always make too much, but it's all good. Take some spoonsful of the turmeric, put it in there. Spoonful even of your whatever flour of choice, either your ground up oat flour or your chickpea flour. A little bit of milk, and I always put honey in mine. And then you're gonna need a cotton ball. You do not wanna put this on your face with your hands or it will stain your hands. And I consider myself dark skin, so I think if you're a little bit, there's people in here that was lighter than me on YouTube that was using it, but it will give your face a little bit of a yellow tint when you go to take it off. So I would do it at night or on the weekend, today, Saturday, but again, it doesn't bother me because I'm darker skin. You do see a little bit of a yellow tint, but it's more of a glow. And some of them are a little bit um, way smoother than mine, but I kind of like the texture of mine because when I go to wash it off, it's kind of exfoliating at the same time. And it did stain the nose pieces of my glasses under there, but that's all right. I mean, no big deal. And it said not to put it on like your eyebrows or near your hairline because it can remove hair. It said 16 or under, so I don't know. I'm not 16. I'm almost 37, so. Ooh, I better get that off the towel. That will stain. All right, so I'm just going to put this on. It's nice and cold. I'll leave it on until it's totally dry, and your face will get really tight. I've tried it with just the, just the turmeric powder and the milk, and it doesn't seem to tighten up my face as much as when I put the chickpea flour or the oat flour in with it. I know it looks a hot mess, but put that over there. Yeah, you don't want people to think you're jaundiced. So don't go put this on right before you go into a, some kind of party or something. People think you're crazy. Just gonna rub it on. And also, I've been drinking golden milk. Golden milk is so good, but it really depends on the type of milk you use. I have been using almond milk from So Delicious because it's thicker than the regular almond milk from the whatever brand I use. I can't remember the blue box. But the So Delicious almond milk is thicker and it's really good and it's really warming. And so just Google golden milk or type in golden milk into YouTube and there's this um, woman with a, a turban on and she explains it really well. Make sure you have a stainless steel pot when you're doing your golden milk. All right, so I'm just gonna leave this on 20 to 30 minutes till it dries. And that's it. I might, if I have time, I might come back and show you the yellow tint that I have. But there was an Asian chick that was doing it as well and she did it because she had dark circles on her eyes and the yellow kind of covered up the dark circles that she would have so yeah that's it turmeric face mask good for fine lines wrinkles softness hydration all kinds of good